looking online and I noticed that there was a thread about 15 stone babies. And I have such mixed emotions about that show. Like, I really feel as if they did a lot of things wrong with it. Um, and I know that for like sensationalism that they needed to show problems with each couple because you know that was how you know people will find things interesting but they really did anybody who was involved a disservice because they mainly focused on the problems and not really the solutions so like the other big storyline was like they had been married for a lot of years and clearly things are going pretty well if they've been together for so long and then they just wanted to focus on the fact that like you know sometimes he saw girls that like to age play being little girls and that made her insecure or something but that was by no means anything important that like was about the show at all like it wasn't a huge problem that this couple had at all um and it was like the same thing with me and Justin. It was like, you know, if you listen to what I said, and the thing is that I used to feel like I was five or six, but now I felt like I was two or three. You know, but then the narration was just like, Justin is forcing her to do X, Y, and Z. She even has to get her hair approved by Justin. Which is really ridiculous because all I was saying was Justin likes my hair and pigtails, so I like to wear my hair and pigtails because that makes sense. So, and then they had that really weird bit in there with baby powder, and so clearly it's like this sexual thing. And I was like, if you're trying to get people to understand that this is, you know, not about children, this is not about, you know, being perverted or anything like that then why would you put in that part like that just that doesn't make any sense to me at all so having been a part of that documentary it would take a lot to get me to be in some other sort of documentary because i mean nope 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 there was just a lot of inconsistencies in there I didn't like how they said oh well I'm a baby girl and I was like but yeah I'm a mommy and they like mentioned that I was in school but that you know that was not but they, they didn't really even show any footage of me at school so I wanted them people that were strangers to know that I'm very competent and you know that I'm not a little girl all the time because I'm definitely not a little girl all the time so I just didn't really like the way that I was portrayed either. Even though they were really nice in the way that they portrayed me. I just thought that it wasn't really very good. And then I was like, okay, so there's this problem with the other couple. Because they're doing bdsm -y stuff. And I'm like, I do bdsm stuff all the time and it's not a problem. So why didn't they just, like, focus on the things that weren't problems for people? Like okay I'm into BDSM no big deal like I'm a sadist I like spanking I like well I could go on and on but this is a g-rated program so we're not gonna go there <sighs> so yeah like Justin and I's relationship I like force I like resistance play I liked all of that stuff all of the things that they said were problems were really not problems at all. They were more like turn-ons. And I really liked the care I received and stuff. So, yeah. And I also didn't like the fact that they changed the name of the show. So, until the day before, it was called Forever Young. And that was 15 Stone Baby. I am not 15 Stone. I'm not even close to 15 Stone. I think that's ridiculous. What they did with that is they made it seem like every single person was like 118 million pounds. And that is not true. We are not all 118 million pounds, just pathetic losers sitting in diapers all day. We are real people with real lives. That is important. So, I have a lot to say on 15 Stone Babies, and I've, you know, blogged about that here and there. Um, 
I probably will blog about it again, but I just saw a thread and then it was like, oh, you know, I'm gonna respond to this because so many people think that Justin was like a pedophile or something like that. And nope, that is not how that went down at all. He was like the bestest daddy a girl could hope for. Yeah, he was pretty awesome and amazing. But anyways, don't believe everything you see on TV or the internet, peoples, because it's not always real. You're being sold a story. Don't believe everything you hear, okay? Okay.